What's up? It's Christmas Stone Fox Media, and I hope you guys are having a blessed day. Now, I wanted to make this uh, primarily a channel update video, but there is a brief bit of gaming news I did want to tell you guys about that did catch my attention. This is a public service announcement to let you guys know to not be fooled. Uh, if you do notice a random mark on my head, I don't quite know how that got there. I don't know if my, like, my, my dog punched me or my wife hit me in the head with a hammer while I was asleep. I don't know what, what this is and how it got here, but this is a mark. I mean, and, 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 and it, don't, it don't hurt no more, but I don't know what happened there. But let me tell you guys what's going on in Gaming New just briefly. This basically is one of those videos that just kind of catches your attention and makes you go, what just happened? So it looks like a gaming retailer in the UK did put that Mario Kart 8 Deluxe is coming on Xbox One. I know, I know, I know. You're probably saying, what? Why would they say that? It's because they actually said it. If you look down here, you'll actually see that they put Mario Kart 8 Deluxe inside of an Xbox One casing. They say pre-order now, out 280417. This is not a drill. Now, when I saw this, I was like, wait, what? What just happened? Did this? Did Microsoft do some micro dollars and make this happen? No, they did not. This company is apparently just foolish because this is not the first time they did it. Apparently, they've done this before. Because when you look at this article right here, you can actually see that they posted pictures of 1-2-Switch, the Nintendo Switch pre-order as if it is a game and not a game console, The Legend of Zelda, and telling you all to pre-order these things. This is not the first time. I don't know if they're trolling. I don't know if they're like probably a little incompetent if they're just like oh just slap stickers on anything but it's there and it's wrapped and it looks all pretty and professional if you go into one of these stores and i don't know the name of this new this uk store do not go to this store don't go to this store because you might pre-order something and be ready to pick it up and they're like oh i'm sorry we just we just like took your money and then and then we ain't got it so would you like your game credit back don't do this. Don't go to this place. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. This is not very professional. Now, let me tell you guys what's going on in a brief channel update real quick. Uh, I am showing you guys uh, some some brief images of the chunk of the basement I took out to make a, a, a actual office in. Uh, this office has been primarily my goal since we moved into this house in October and I was like okay I need an office I need a good size office to be able to do all the shows I'm going to be able to do for you guys uh one of which of course is going to be gaming news so Lord willing when all the carpet is put in maybe this weekend I should be moving into my office next week Lord willing and that would be really awesome because I really can't wait to just get back to to my normal setup uh so one office is going to be for the gaming news i'm going to have one separate area for the news show i'm going to be doing i know i've been talking about that news show forever but i never had the space to do it so glory to god has been built so i actually have a space uh for a actual news show and uh gonna be doing a, a really cool christian show i, I, I want to do one of those too this is going to be basically a actual studio with multiple different little areas to actually do different shows another area for unboxings this is this is where it's going to go down so i am very happy about this and uh it's been certified by colorado so it is legit it's not like a hack job done by like a random dude well i am the random dude it was done by but the glory god is not a hack job everything's been signed off from the electrical the building the hvac everything's been signed off so this is fantastic and uh thank you guys for being so patient with me and and putting up with the green screen and the stuff like that that i don't typically do uh for all my subscribers that have known how long i've been doing this i have not been known for doing green screens for a particularly long amount of time except for when i was doing my my awesome characters which i do want to bring my my characters back i do i do i do i do i do so uh i am getting uh so hype and i was just walking around like wow this is it this is it, man. This is it, it's about to go down. So thank you guys for being so patient with me. Uh, it's a lot of shows that's gonna be coming. Everything from live streams, you name it. This is basically gonna be like a full time operation. So thank you guys for your patience. Well, that's all the news I got for you guys right now. Like, subscribe, follow me on Twitch, Twitter, and Facebook. So you know as soon as my news becomes available. Thank you guys for watching. God bless, and I'll holler at y'all later.